Hey guys, wanted to make a quick video on how to use NVIDIA's new OC scanner to overclock your GTX 10 series Pascal card. I'm going to be doing this uh, with MSI Afterburner. There are other applications uh, which you can do it through. I'll uh, make, make some other videos uh, showing how to do that. But for now, the first thing we want to do is we want to make sure that we have the correct version of MSI Afterburner. So we're going to go ahead and uh, open up the web and I'll go ahead and include the uh, correct link on the page below and then once we open it up we're going to scroll down and we're going to want to click on download and it's going to be version 4.6.0 beta 10 build so go ahead and click on that download it install it and once it's installed go ahead and, and fire up your MSI afterburner application once it opens up if it's the first time it should look something like this um, and the first thing you're going to want to do is head over to settings uh, over here on the left hand side it's a little gear icon and once you open it up we want to make sure that there's these boxes are checked uh, and that's the unlock voltage control and the unlock voltage monitoring uh, once that's done click on apply and then click on OK and then we're gonna want to head back over here and click on the core voltage and we're gonna want to set that to max and we're also gonna want to set the power limit to max and the temp limit to max so the top three the, uh, the figures that you see on your computer may be a little different than what I have here and the reason for that is that these figures are actually set by the manufacturer of your video card so they're safe limits that are set uh, once these three are set to max you want to go ahead and apply by clicking the check mark we'll head over here to the left hand side and we'll notice that MSI Afterburner has added a new OC icon that you're going to want to open up and once you open it up you get two features uh, test and scan the test is uh, basically a feature that you can use later to test how well the curve uh, the overclocking curve that NVIDIA has put on your GPU is basically you know whether you're gonna have any issues with it later on but to set the curve to begin with the first thing you want to do is click the scan button now I'm not gonna do it now because it takes about 10 to 15 minutes but once you click scan let it do its thing and you'll notice when she's done she'll actually give you a message uh, saying finish and once it's finished you want to go ahead and click that little X close out of there and your computer your MSI afterburner will look something like this you'll notice that under core clock it has the word curve now that is the overclocking curve that the uh, NVIDIA basically application has added to your profile so you want to make sure that before you close this out you click the apply button if you don't click apply uh, and you close out you will have to do the entire thing over which will take you about 10 to 15 minutes uh, but once you hit apply and you close out you have now overclocked uh, your GTX 10 series card with NVIDIA's new OC scanner if this video was helpful at all guys uh, quick thumbs up and uh, have fun overclocking